How did you come across Sean Connery? When did you say you had to leave? Immediately. I was a stand-in for a movie called The Anderson Tapes. I haven't been late in over 10 years. 10 years? I learned how to listen okay. by watching Sean Connery. Then, probably 15 years later, I've, I've, I've done Karate Kid. I'm a little more established. And I bump into him on a tennis court. I said to him, do you remember me? I was just standing. He says, no. <laughs> he said, no, but do you want to hit the ball? And I right. said, sure. And I, we're hitting the ball, and he was terrible. He wasn't hitting well. He had a back problem. Oh, boy. And he was cursing. But he was cursing so much like we do as teenagers, and I'm cracking up hysterical. Because I'm saying on the other side of the court, I'm playing tennis with James Bond, and he's cursing just like I do.